I am the future of stem cell research. 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 So this is the Bridges program poster session. For many of these students, is the first time they've ever presented a poster. And so it's their opportunity to tell us what they've been doing over their training period, usually six months to one year. We're working on curing HIV by targeting a gene that will make your immune cells resistant to HIV infection. So basically I am using embryonic stem cells, differentiating them into articular cartilage in hopes that we can someday use it to replace the lesions caused by osteoarthritis. We can take um, skin cells from schizophrenics and directly convert them into brain cells that recapitulate their disease. The fact that we're investing the money in these students and allowing them to grow, giving them the freedom to expand their knowledge and contribute to research, I don't think there is anything comparable to the Bridges to Stem Cell Research Program at any university right now. A lot of the students were thinking, oh, I'm just going to get an AS degree and then that's it, and now they're all talking PhD. Well, I've gotten a really good idea of what it's like to be in a lab every day, doing research, learning, and uh, what it would be like to get a PhD. And a year ago, if you would have showed them a figure and say, analyze this, they would have been intimidated by it. Now, they will tell you what it means, and then they'll ask you questions that are kind of hard to answer. When the Bridges program was brought to us, um, I was pretty excited about it for a couple of reasons. One is that I thought it gave us an opportunity to interest students at a much earlier stage in their training and development. And also the fact that we were going into the CSU system and into the junior colleges, that we would get a more diverse population of students who reflect you know, what California is like these days. After the Bridges program, I want to go for a PhD program. I'm applying to medical school right now. I am applying to uh, an MD-PhD program. I actually was accepted at the University of Oregon for their PhD program in molecular biology. Recruiting young people into doing stem cell science is going to change the world. So that's, that's pretty neat to be a part of.